Some athletes are more than meets the eye. That's the case for Royals forward Scott Tansky, who is on a mission to end the stigma surrounding mental health after forming a relationship with former NHL defenseman Luke Richardson. They tragically lost their, their daughter to uh, suicide. Seeing how the family kind of persevered through that, came together, started this DIFD uh, foundation in the Ottawa area, which is Do It For Darren. His daughter's name was Darren. Kind of made me feel very positive about the impact they were having on something that you know really isn't talked about a whole lot. That's when Tansky decided to use his platform for the greater good, forming the Tansky Talks initiative to raise money and support for mental health awareness wherever the game takes him. A lot of people feel ashamed sometimes about the things that they're going through and they don't need to, you know, and sometimes people don't have to take the uh, certain measures that, that they think that they need to, you know, especially with like people taking their own lives and things like that. I think that if you can get out there and you can end the stigma and, and start some communications, especially in places like here, South Carolina, Ottawa, all the places I've been, I feel like if I can help those communities and help just like a few people, you know, it'll be worth it for sure. After four different teams over eight professional seasons, Tansky found his own personal refuge through an unlikely passion in abstract painting. There's ups and downs in the sport that we play here. It's, um, it's definitely very mental, you know, half of it, you know, with good games and bad games and call ups and down and, you know, you've been working your whole life in this, organ in this uh, scenario, especially for us for like 20 some years and, you know, that's all a lot of us have really known. So the best sometimes that can affect us. I just think that the time while painting for me where I had to put all those negative thoughts and put all the, the wonders about what's going on and the stresses away for those one or two hours gave me a peace and kind of you know put me in a state where I was focused on creating something and not focused on all the outside factors that were affecting so even if it's not painting if it's anything just getting involved in certain things that can you know keep your attention on something else other than you know anxiety or depression or things like that, I think it's positive for it. His paintings, which now line the walls of him and his teammates' apartments in Reading, have now become more than just a decoration. People started commenting on you know, some of my pictures, how they really enjoyed it and they liked it. And I was like, wow, this could be something that I could you know, use for positive influence. You know, if I can utilize this to raise some money or some awareness for my foundation, Tansky Talks, then it's a different, it's a different way than we've done it in the last three years. So it's something that um, I think not only the money that we're raising, but showing that like doing things outside your comfort zone can sometimes bring you, you know, some stress relief or for uh, for mental health for sure.